All right, so I'm just in uh, the front yard, in our front yard here. Um, our yard is surrounded by some fairly mature Douglas fir. And I've got some rasulas growing here. And I've always been curious of what type these are. And so I was trying to figure them out. And I couldn't quite figure them out initially. But uh, I was at the market today with my wife, and we saw these shrimp rusulas, which I've known about, but I kind of forget about them each year. Anyways, I'll just try to get this out of the bag here. It's a fair size one here. So this was being sold at the market, and it's called a shrimp rusula or a crab brittle, brittle gill mushroom and that's what they look like and now I'm comparing them to what I have in my yard there's another one that I got from the uh, market so they have a bit of a kind of a seafood smell to them and I guess you know what I guess I could do a bit of a taste test on the ones I got from the market just to see, compare. Hmm. Yeah, kind of a mild taste to them. So now I'll pick this one here. Whoops. And I would say that that looks quite similar to this one from the market. Pretty much, pretty much identical. So I think we've got the same mushroom growing in our front yard. Now I'm going to do a bit of a taste test. And it tastes the same. Wow. Well, that's a cool find. Supposed to um, kind of stain brownish, I guess, when handled. Does have a similar smell to it. Yeah. I mean, it, you know, the fish smell to me isn't overwhelming, but it might might be more uh, obvious when they're dried but yeah this is pretty cool here's a few another one there's a nice one the spores are kind of a yellowish color wow that's pretty neat all this time and these grow here every year there's some old ones these are kind of old too that is really neat so yeah, each year I can look out here for these mushrooms. Let's see in the book here, I think. Um, there they are. Cool. Well, see how these taste in uh, a dish. We'll have to prepare them tonight. Fun. So I just picked this one out of here. Just kind of cut it at the base. And uh, yeah, it has a smell of, um, yeah, I would say crab. Yeah, it has like a crab type smell to it. Really interesting so 
I'm really excited to uh, try these. Like I said, I've never tried Rasulas before, so it's, it's pretty cool that I have these in my yard. There's a nice one. Just a little one starting. I don't think I'm going to leave that one for now.